There we go. Layla does it again. Back to back Legos. Just Layla stuff, guys. Just Layla things. Right, we obviously got a couple things going on today. Today is my monthly cosplay stream, and as you can see, I am cosplayed as Vagabond. So you can see the official photo over there on the right. We also have two X Sacreds, and it's also a 10X for Y Through the Crown. I'm gonna be pulling 12 shards for Sandy. Now, Sandy is really, really after a Brogni. She wouldn't mind having a wife of the crown either. I think she really only wants me to pull until she gets a Lego. So we're gonna see what happens there, okay? But she does have 12 to pull during this 2X sacred. And she did redeem a Fox shard pull assistant. So Sandy, good luck. We're starting with a sacrifice to the RNG gods for good favor, divine fortune, and good shard pull, RNG. I mean, we did get a death knight. So a death knight is, you know, that's, we got two death knights, guys. Oh boy, two death knights. All right, here we go. Sandy, good luck. You guys know it only takes one shard. Hopefully that's the case, is that we don't have to pull all 12. We're starting off with a carom, and this could be 11. That's a dwarf. It's not the one she wants, though. It's not the one that she wants. It's not the one that she wants. She wants a barogny. She doesn't want this dude. But hey, I mean, we're already we're pulling some dwarves, so anything can happen. 10 to go. 10. Lego! And it is Skull Lord Vargol. That is not a Brogni. That is not a Wyther. <laughs> Congratulations, there is a legendary. So that was on the third shard. Okay, Sandy says to keep pulling, so we're gonna keep pulling. She's got nine more, nine. Can we get her anything else in here? Let go! Oh, there's Wyther, hey! There we go, back-to-back -back Legos. And there's a Y through the crown. She's the 10X. Hey, congratulations, Miss Sandy. I know you said you would take a Brogni or a Wyther, so congratulations. There we go. Oh, baby, oh, baby, oh, baby. There we go. Layla does it again, back-to-back -back Legos. Just Layla stuff, guys, just Layla things. All right, we got eight left. So far, two Legos, Skull Lord and a Wyther. And we have the, the, the Grinch. All right, seven more. So far, really happy with that Wyther too. Raptor Drath, a fantastic epic, you guys. Such a good epic. All right, six. The Grunch. 10X the Grunch? What be the chances? What be the chances? <laughs> All right, we got five left, five, five. That is Aothar. And Knight Errant. All right, three to go, three. Relic Keeper, you know what, man? Two left, two. Doom Priest, another really, really good epic as well, too. Really, really have to love a Doom Priest. Last one, Leshard. And it is a Old Gruckus. Sandy, thank you so much for my Pooh Shards. Congratulations on your Wyther the Crown. I know you said you wanted either a Brogni or a Wyther. We got you a Wyther. She is the 10X. Congratulations, and thank you so much for letting me pull your shards. All right, guys, it is two X sacreds and a 10 X Y through the crowns. We're gonna be pulling a three lucky sacred shards for Mullet Reaver. Mullet would, you know, he'd like a Wyther. You know, he'd like uh, any Lego he could have fun with. And really, it only takes one shard, guys. So let's see what happens with the three that we have. And we're starting off with Umataki's kind of cool. She reminds me like she should be in Mortal Kombat or something, right? Mortal Kombat. <laughs> One shard in a dream, guys. Old man, holy cosplay, looking good. Thank you, man. All right, two. Lego! And that is a Mountain King. The Dwarf Queen does it again. Hey, now. There we go. There we go. There we go. That's a Mountain King. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Congratulations, man. Congrats on Mountain King. There's the Dwarf Queen just doing Dwarf Queen things. <laughs> nice. 
So it only takes one shard. Three shards, no problem. Three shards, no problem. Congratulations. And one more. One more shard. Oh, another one! Hey, two Legos in a row. Just Layla stuff, guys. Just me doing me. You know what I mean? Eh, eh, you know what I mean? Hey, 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 hey. Congratulations. It's a brave man who puts camel coins against Layla pulling Legos. You have to be brave to assume I'm not gonna pull Legos. Back to back, again. That's the second time tonight. Congratulations on an alt hand. Hey, Mullet, thank you so much for letting me pull your shards. We only had three. We pulled two Legos. We got a Mountain King and we got an Altan. Dude, thank you so much for letting me pull your shards. All right, we have 15 sacred shards for Miss Annie. Now, what we're going to do is we're only going to pull 10. She wants to see what we get out of 10. And then, you know, we're going to decide if we keep pulling or not. So, Annie, good luck. It is 2x sacreds. It is 10x Wyther. So good luck, Annie. Good luck. Now, the last time I pulled shards for Annie was 2x voids. And it was insane. It was so good. It was so insane. So I'm hoping we can get something really good, guys. So Layla, Layla blessings, Layla prayers. Good luck in the channel. Annie, good luck. So we're only going to pull 10, you guys. Then we're just going to see what happens, OK? We're just going to see what happens. It only takes one. And we're starting with Caden. Caden's actually pretty good. He's a good reviver for the Dark Elves. Layla, typical dwarfs. Grizzle Jarl, he's a good dwarf too. Good dwarf. Lego! All right, so we got a Scar Torsus. Congratulations, so that is one Lego right there. Hey! That's a Lego, that's a Lego. I think I still have a 100% Lego win pull rate for Miss Annie. Congrats, Annie. Hey now. Go, so that is one Lego. That is one. What else can we get? Jirojin. All right, that is a Sand Lash Survivor. So she is a good one. She is definitely a very nice epic to have as well, too. She has a Provoke on her A1 and also heals. A2 is an AoE, decrease the duration of enemy buffs, called Endless Sands. Passives, ally protect, block damage, and ally defense in all battles. So she is a really good one for sure. And that is a Corpse Collector. Jerang. Hey, Lord, thank you so much. And that's a Chancellor Yasmin. Lord, thank you so much for 500 bits. That gets you a name on one of the Vagmon baby heads. Hey, and the backup dancers. Thank you so much, Lord. Hey. You guys got the Murlocs. Let's see them. Thank you so much. Let me get you a baby head. All right. Here's one right here. Let's write your name on that. Where'd my marker go? Here we go. Yes. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. There you go. Your name is on one of the Vagabond baby heads. Thank you very, very much. Okay. So seven, we have two more, two more. Two more, let's go. And then we'll decide what to do after that. For Silas Grave Dirt and last one, last shard. Lego! Oh, Mother Sybil. Okay. I mean, she's a good one. Annie, congratulations. That's two. Did you ever do the fusion for Mother Sybil? She's really good for Hydra as well, too. Now, I know I told you guys this before. So I'm such a fan of champs that have decreased speed, have turn meter manipulations on their A1. That's exactly what she has. She actually has both, right? She has AOE, decreased speed, and fills her turn meter by 15% on her A1. I love that. She's also allies between all battles by 24% as well, too. 
um, she's a dupe, so you might empower her. So what I would do is look at your guardian circle first. I would not empower until your guardian circle's full. I mean, that, that's just honestly what I think. And then, like I said, she's fantastic for Hydra. So considering you need three teams for Hydra, I would keep them for two different Hydra teams. But that's what I would do with them, is I wouldn't use her as an empower. All right, congratulations. Joy to pull them all. Awesome. Guys, she's in it. We're pulling them all. Okay. So, guys, we pulled 10. And we got two Legos so far. Miss Annie said pull them all. So I got five more. We got five more. Let's do this. So far, two Legos. She's happy with both of them. That is Urticata. Urticata is such an interesting champ. She reminds me of a praying mantis. Also, if you guys do not know, I know Deadwood was here earlier. He has a YouTube video out where I think he's got an unkillable comp with Urticata in it, which is really interesting. All right, four. Oh, just Layla pulling dwarves. Creepy Canelia. Creepy Canelia. And three. And Necro Hunter, also known as the Turkey. Gobble, gobble. Two. Jiggle Hunter, wrong season, bro. Dude, it's not winter. Well, maybe it's winter somewhere, but it's summer where I am. And one. And it's Tayrell. Guys, Tayrell is still one of my favorite epics in the game. I know that he got power crept on, but he's still one of my absolute favorite epics in the game. He's got a decreased attack on the A1. His A2 is an AOE, decreased defense, decreased attack, and could also do a sleep. A3 decreases turn meter, can also do a stun, and ally defense allows by 25%. So again, he's, also, he's always been one of my absolute favorite epics. Always will be, you know what I mean? Even though, like I said, I know he got power crept on. Really great though. Annie, thank you so much for letting me pull your shards. We got you two Legos. We got your Scortorsis and we got you Mother Cybel. Thank you so much for letting me pull. And recording. Say hi to mommy, cause we're on TV guys. In five, four, three, two. All right, I got 15 sacred shards for species during this 2X sacred and the 10X Y through the crown. Species really, really wants an allure. Obviously, we'll take some Legos, obviously. However, really, 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 really wants an allure. So species, good luck. I'm hoping we can get you what you want, what you really, really want. Lego! Arrow 404. Lego, not found. <laughs> well. Ma. Okay then, that's that's a start. <laughs> Errol 404. Errol 404, Lego not found. Okay. Guys, Species says he's not a duplicate. So. Okay, we did a thing. We did a thing, you guys. Not a duplicate. Let's keep going. <laughs> oh my gosh, Necker hunted the turkey. Can we, I don't know, can we get a redemption? Can we get a redemption? <laughs> Torture Helm, we have 12 more. We have 12 more. Lego! Okay, Roxum! Roxanne! Gotta turn out the lights, Roxanne! Hey, now what about Roxum? Is Roxum a dupe? That's two. Congratulations, two Legos. All right, guys. So Species says Roxum is new, not a duplicate. Not a duplicate. How about that? We're doing really good. So two Legos, both are non-duplicates. And we still have 11 shards to go. Hey. All right, that is not a man eater. That's a grim skin. Ten and Omega. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate that. Lego, <gasps> my salad, yo. Yo, come on now. Only the queen does things like this. Come on. Oh my goodness, what? Okay, that makes up for an Errol 404. That just cleared the Errol 404. The error is cleared. I repeat, the error is cleared. Dude! Layla, I love you. 
Oh, congratulations. I'm a salad. I'm so excited for you, dude. Oh, we know he's tough. The salad bar is open, bruh. Layla, brola. Layla, bro, brola. Just coming in clutch. Hope you like vegetables. You just got a salad. <laughs> Player stock of Lego's almost empty, Layla. Stop it. <laughs> Stop it, Layla. All right, this dude made up for Arrow 404. Dude, my salad. Congratulations. Congratulations. What kind of salad's your favorite? A my salad? <laughs> uh, I know, guys. We, have, we always have all kinds of jokes in this channel. We still got nine left. Oh, my God. <laughs> Somebody stop me. Just kidding. Don't stop me. Don't stop me. Don't stop me. We got nine. <laughs> I know he still wants an allure, you know? But, you know, we got you a salad. Masamoto, so we have eight left. So far, three Legos, that's pretty great. Hellgazer. Man, that's spicy salad, yo. And Scabrious Mr. Nibbles, he's the one. Six to go, six. Chani. Chani's really interesting. I think she kind of looks cool, too. I like her outfit. I think she looks really neat. All right, five more. Gonna need a lot of dressing for that salad. Yep. Definitely gonna need a lot of dressing. And a Chinoru. And a Chinoru. Okay. Gerard the Stone. Three more. Three. All right, guys. What's your favorite kind of salad, and why is it a um, salad? Two. That's a Lady of Tesla, last sacred, and one. That is a Talia. Hey, my, my twin. I'm twinning here. Basically, I'm basically Talia with the red hair, right, guys? That's what you guys said when I uh, when I did the red hair. Because you guys didn't say War Maiden. I wear too much clothing to be War Maiden, apparently. But you guys did say Talia. So, yo, species, dude. Congratulations. Congratulations on your three Legos. We got your Arrow 404, Roxum, and Masalad, with Masalad just being that clutch pull for sure. Thank you so much, Lee Pull. Congratulations. Latalia, yeah, basically, right? Hey, if you enjoyed this video, check out some more videos up here in the playlist on the top right.